Here's the 2-2 pitch. Swinging a line drive into center field. Von Krellen on the run. He can't get it. It just goes all the way to the wall. Wilner will pull up at second with a stand-up double. And the Moichens are in business in the top half of the first. Or bottom of the first, excuse me. Oh, Wilner with a lot of power, like I had mentioned earlier. Um, just got a hold. It looked like uh, looked like he got a breaking ball again, Anthony. And uh, kind of some pretty decent speed, too, on the base pass. So it'd be good to get him on base in front of Wilner. Here's a line drive into left center field. This one's going to be in the gap and go all the way to the wall. Irving pulls into second with a double. So the Moichens can get the leadoff man aboard here in the third. They had Wilner aboard with a leadoff double in the first, couldn't get him around, and now they'll get another chance with Irving at second and nobody out. There's a, another look at it there as uh, Irving just drove that into the, the power alley out there in left center. An excellent uh, pitch for Irving to hit right in his power zone, and he drove. And now Knight appears to have settled in a little bit too after struggling in the first. But here's a rocket hit to right field. No chance for Leitner on this one. It goes all the way to the wall. They will hold Boyce at third and Leitner slide, or Hefter slides into second with a double. And the Moichens are in business now here in the fourth with two in scoring position and nobody out. A really nice hit by Wade Hefter. That's the first shot that's really gone the other way. Here's a 3-2 pitch. Curveball is hit high and deep to left center field. This one has a chance. It is gone. And Dave Wilner gets the Moichens on the scoreboard. It's now a 3-1 ball game. So Wilner continues to swing the hot bat, his fourth home run in the last two ball games. And the Moitens are on the board. Now it'll be interesting to see how Darren Knight reacts. Here's the 2-2 pitch. Swing and a tapper back to the mound. This could be two to second for one. The relay, double play. Nice double play and a big job by Jeff Dainty. It's a tall order. a curve ball that is laced down the right field line. This one's going to go all the way to the wall. Boyce rounds first and he will pull into second with a double. So the Moichens with a runner in scoring position on the two out double by Boyce and now Wade Hefter with a chance to draw his team within one. Take another look at it here. Pitch was right down the middle. Very nice hit and a good camera angle. Boyce just went with the pitch. Now we have to are going to have to try to pick up the slack here. He swings and hits one pretty well into the left center field gap. This will get a run home. Hefter rounds first. He's going to try and go to second. The throw, not in time. And a double for Wade Hefter. And it's a 3-2 ball game on back-to-back -back two out doubles and from Boyce and Hefter. And I think part of this has to do with Knight. He's already thrown 150 pitches. And there you see a nice shot to the left center field gap. And I'm a little bit surprised that they sent Hefter. He was very nearly out at second base and you don't want to take yourself out of a late inning rally. So you won't see Dainty pitching around Leitner here to get to him. Here's a ground ball up the middle. Irving ranging to his right. Long throw. Got him. Nice play by Dale Irving at second base. Moving up to third on the play is Van Crevelin, but Irving showing some pretty good range to his right on that one. 